welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. Today I have a super fun recipe for you. I am taking it back to simple. K-I-S-S, -S. keep it simple, sweetie. We have a sheet pan dinner recipe that is literally to die for. It is a rainbow of colors of vegetables paired with some sausage and it was so incredibly delicious and super low in smart points. So if you want an easy meal idea, literally it takes you 20 minutes to throw it in the oven, sheet pan recipe, just stay tuned. On the run from my given disaster. Speed away from the holy mind, pride That's where I never thought it would matter For tonight's dinner, we are going to be making a sheet pan dinner. These are easy, clean up, one pan, delicious meals. Typically there's lots of vegetables that get nice and roasted and delicious. So tonight we're gonna be doing a sausage sheet pan dinner. So let me show you what is in tonight's dinner. You're going to need some fingerling potatoes, salt and pepper, any type of grainy or stone ground mustard, sugar-free honey. I'm going to be using the Nature's Hollow Honey Substitute. I do purchase this off of Nutrition. It is only one Smart Point per tablespoon, so it's great on Smart Points. Literally tastes like honey. I really, really like this. So you can again buy this on Nutrition. There's a link down in the description box. And then I'm going to be doing Italian seasoning and red chili pepper flakes. The sausages I'm going to be using are the Sam's Choice Chicken Apple. These are mine and my husband's very favorite. Great, clean ingredients and only two smart points a piece. You'll need a medium-sized red onion, a medium to large sweet potato, and then a whole bunch of fresh Brussels sprouts. So let's get started on tonight's dinner. All right, so the first thing we need to do is chop, chop, chop. We're going to go ahead and slice the stem off of these, cut these in half, peel and dice those, cut our onion into wedges, and we're gonna actually cut these fingerling potatoes in half. So let's get chopping so we can get this sheet pan dinner in the oven. together here so we can get our veggies and potatoes and all the good stuff in the oven. I have my oven preheating right now to 400 degrees. So I'm going to add two tablespoons of my stone ground or your spicy mustard to a large bowl because we're actually going to be mixing everything in this one bowl. So we need quite a large bowl. I'm also going to add in two tablespoons of my sugar-free honey. The recipe also calls for olive oil, which I I omitted just to save on some points and then I'm gonna add just a little bit of red chili pepper flakes we do not like our spood spood food spicy so just a little bit of that and then some Italian seasoning I'm gonna put in a couple of teaspoons worth of Italian seasoning here and then I'm also going to put in a couple good pinches of both salt and pepper. And then we're going to whisk this together or mix this up. And this is going to be what's going to coat our veggies and potatoes and give them kind of that nice glaze before they go into the oven. So we're going to go ahead and add in all of our veggies and potatoes. So here are our cut in half fingerling potatoes. We're also going to add this huge bowl. This is why this bowl needed to be rather large of our sweet potatoes, Brussels sprouts, red onions, and we're going to give this a mix until they're coated with that sauce that we just made. This, it smells really good with that mustard and honey. Oh, yum. So we're just going to mix until everything's nice and coated. Now we're gonna go ahead and take this beautiful mix and just put this onto a parchment paper lined sheet pan. Whatever is left in the bottom for sauce, which it looks like there's just the tiniest bit, go ahead and leave that in your bowl because we're gonna go ahead and toss the sausages in this bowl as well so you can see there's still a little bit left. 
just to coat those with some of that yummy sauce. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing, you guys. How beautiful, too, with all these colors. So we're just gonna get this out even on our baking sheet here, and then we are going to toss our sausages into that same bowl and get those coated with some of this sauce added my sausages here to the bowl I'm just gonna take a knife and I'm just going to pierce my sausages just a couple of times before I roll them in this sauce that's going to help them from expanding and kind of exploding throughout the cooking process so go ahead and just pierce them a few times with a knife and then again we're just gonna roll them in this remaining sauce and a little bit of veggie that's in there and get those coated and what we're going to do with our sausages then is we are going to place them directly on top here of our vegetables so i'm just going to place them right on top and then these are going to go into a 400 degree oven until everything is nice and cooked through so about 40 to 45 minutes we are going to want to rotate and flip these sausages midway through and make sure our vegetables get cooked all the way through as well but doesn't this look so beautiful and amazing so i'm going to go ahead and get this into a 400 degree oven and i'll be back to show you our dinner and give you the smart points what's it like to be the one that he comes to when he wants to dance just pulled the sausage sheet pan dinner out of the oven you guys oh my goodness this looks so good so this entire sheet pan is four servings isn't that crazy so four servings one sausage link per serving plus all the potatoes sweet potatoes brussels sprouts onions so i'm going to go ahead and plate up one fourth of the recipe and i'll be back to show you my dinner and give you the smart points so here is my dinner. So I have one fourth of the veggie and potato mixture along with one full sausage link. So the points on this is going to be six smart points on both the blue and green plan and two smart points on the purple plan. But look at this, you guys. Yum. I'm going to go ahead and add some honey mustard here to my plate for my sausage. Let me show you the honey mustard I'm using. So this is the honey mustard that I like. This is the French's honey mustard. So I'm going to add one point worth of that so that I can put that on my sausage or dip my sausage in that. So you guys, how amazing is this? So this is going to be seven smart points total including the honey mustard. Thank you for joining me on tonight's sheet pan recipe. This is such an easy, fast meal for those busy weekday nights, weekend, when you come home from the gym, when you're swamped with kids activities, this is a great dinner and it is delicious. It is family friendly and is packed full of all of the necessary nutrients that a dinner should have. And those smart points are incredible. The recipe is linked down in the description box below. Make sure you check that out as well as all of the links and discount codes of some of my favorite things that I can offer you a savings on. That's always a win-win. Also in the description box is the link to my Facebook group. So come on over and join us there. We'd love to have you be part of our 14,000 plus and growing community. It's a great place to be. Lots of support and encouragement over on my Facebook group. If you're new, welcome welcome i'd love for you to stick around make sure you hit that subscribe button and that little bell that way you're just notified whenever i upload a new video i do upload almost daily so you don't want to miss out i'd appreciate a big thumbs up if you loved this sheet pan recipe it really helps out my channel and leave those comments down below i want to know are you going to give this recipe a try highly highly recommend thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye